A former professional boxer is fighting for her community in Albuquerque. Victoria Cisneros is a mother, and she's a role model to her southeast Albuquerque neighborhood. She's teaching kids who may be down and out how to box and get back up. Our Megan Abundance has this week's Pay It Forward. She's an awesome woman. I think she stands for a lot of women out there as far as volunteering. She's a pro boxer. She takes time out to help kids that can't afford boxing and then she's helped me. She stepped up to help me train. She found out what I was doing and she offered to train without asking for any money. I'm going to cry. <laughs> anyway, she's just awesome. Okay, Michelle, are you ready to go pay it forward? I am. Okay. 100, 200, 300, 400. Can I run with it then? Okay. You. Oh She's going to save you. I just wanted to let you know that I nominated you because you go out of your way to help people. And that means a lot to me. So here, and I'm at the gym. Thank you. This means a lot to me. I do the sport because I love it. I'm a professional boxer. I fought Holly Holm. Cisneros went the distance with Holm. Top fighters, but I do it because it's my passion. And helping out the kids, I do it because my son and my daughter, they work out with me. So if it wasn't for them and how we live in a bad neighborhood, so you know, half the kids that work out with me are either are recovering from drugs, on the street. I put all my money into equipment. The kids don't pay nothing. So it is what it is. You know, I love what I do. I was raised in, in the neighborhood. It's tough, so just giving back. When you're a woman and you have a passion for something so deep and you're a mom and you work and you got to go home and clean and cook and do all this other stuff, she's an inspiration to others. And to me, she's a big inspiration because she still fights and that's her passion. That was our Megan Abundance reporting. Now, Victoria Cincinnati's recently found out that she is pregnant. She says after the baby is born, you could expect to see her fighting in the ring professionally once again. And in the meantime, she will continue to train at the Jack Candelaria Community Center.